day two of the GTC4 at the lovely Anglesey Golf Course situated in Anglesey. It's a par 73 today. Do you have any quick facts you can spit at us? <laughs> uh, over 6,000 metres from the, from the tip. As you said, par 73, which is a first for the GTC. Uh, excited to see what Anglesey has to offer. All we know about it is there's meant to be kangaroos absolutely everywhere. Yet to see one yet. Yes. So, don't know. Hopefully we just see them around around the traps. <laughs>
Get in the hole. Oh, Jack. Nice shot. Oh, he's back. Yeah, Jordan as well, lovely. Could this be the great undoing? On eight. Good out. Nice. I run. I don't do. Lesson for everyone out here, when you're putting from a meter, take the pin out. We've just had it trickle out off the pin, cost me another shot, back to even for the day. What's been your least favorite thing about the course today, Jack? Yeah. Hondo? Uh, least favorite thing? Probably the greens. Like very bumpy and very slow, very up and down. Being a little bit tricky. Um, but I'm not playing good anyway, so. My favorite thing? company. You called me a shit bloke before. Steve's oh. been, yeah, Steve's been, been great. <laughs> How nice is that? The greens, the greens have been caught about a month ago, I think. So that's been the, uh, that's been the issue. Um, so not necessarily Anglesey's fault. I tell you what, the, the real issue is <clears throat> the way they can improve is just after the tee boxes. It's just like sand and dirt. So if you're going to go to like a nice, a nice course, they make sure they're architecturally savvy to make sure that everything's in top, top shape. Um, you know, the cart paths are just like some stone. Gravel. And then everything after the tee box is just dirt. So is isn't necessarily looked after, but they do look after the tee boxes, some parts of the fairway, and then obviously the greens. I think the bunker's been all right too. The bunker's your positive. Any other positives? We coming back? I wouldn't come back, no. Not for the price. That's a, that's a good shot. Oh, you think Clubhouse leader shit in the bed after his front nine holes. Um, Come on, Stephen. Got... A sandwich or a sand wedge? Both. By the looks of that, you need a miracle. Down the hill. Big snap, right angle, dog leg left. Oh, mate, because today, oh, I've only taken the piss in the bushes looking directly at me just to put his dick out. He's <laughs> <laughs> blocked his mates off, he's blocked his mates off the tree and he's looking right at me. I'm like, oh, look, you pissed with that thing. <laughs> Early leader, Dean. It's another fairway, Dean. I'm winning, I'm even or one over, one under, one over. We tied together. Sting. Even a bad for after a hot start. You were four under early. I was think I was I was two under. You were four under, and then we both shut the bed. Kanga, Kanga, Kanga. Roo, roo, roo. <laughs> Send that to North Melbourne for some uh, membership marketing. There you go. Shot. Almost true, but all right, safe. How'd you feel about that one? Uh, I tried to actually take it slower, and that, I reckon I went too quick. Got ahead of myself. I'm winning. Swing speed and you can't hack it. Don't have Just got to slow the swing speed down. So we're here on the 12th. This is typically where I melt down. 
I've got a two shot lead, which is probably a one hole lead. I've got one wipe in the pocket. Um, it's fair to say I'm really trying to be confident. Don't let anybody else know that. That's just our secret. Uh, close to the pin on day two of GTC4 at Anglesey here. Uh, we are at the 13th, uh, 118, as you can see behind me. Downhill, downwind, uh, the four lads in front of us. Supposedly, one was basically a bee's diaphragm off the green at the front. Another one was maybe a couple of bee's diaphragms off the green at the front, so no dice there. It's up to these four fellas, including myself, to show them how it's done. I don't go from home from the weekend empty-handed. That's so good. No one can take it away from me. The 13th. And it's 15 metres away. Jeez, it's, it's rolled back a bit. I'll be about 10 metres from the pin, but I've won. Let's get scratching. Let's get scratching. Jeez, you're hitting the ball well, Hondo. Yeah, it's very good. But yeah, I can't play that other f***ing golf. Let's get scratching. Let's get scratching. Let's get scratching. Did it so through, what do we are? We're up to the 16th hole. We found our signature hole here at uh, Anglesey. Give us a bit of a rundown, Steve. Yeah, I don't know um, too much online. They didn't really give us too much saying, oh, this is a signature hole of Anglesey. This is the hole to look out for. So we didn't really know what to expect when we were going into you know what to look for but standing up to the 16th tee box 124 meter par three that view that uh bunkering couple of bunkers in basically perfect location this i feel just from a visual perspective is the signature hole nice shot jack just gotta get up there Bit of the local wildlife watching us on 16 here. Three days never. Give us a bit of aim point, Stephen. Maxi Homer. Four hour, 15 minute round already. That's a great part. That's a good part. Great. Really hoping I drop that then. Everyone will be like, oh, aim point works. Aim point works. Fuck the fucking ball move. The ball move. Yeah, it's when you hit it. Yeah. Hardest hole on the course. Couple of big dogs rolling up to the uh, 
longest drive hole. Final hole of the day. Look at these yeah. pipes coming at you. Look at these bad boys. Back tees. Lovely sitting area to watch the longest drive. Oh, what a bunny. Oh, bunny. Take the rabbits out. Not, uh, not for the first time on the GTC Thank channel. Uh, just wrapped up our 18 holes and everyone's looking really excited. Uh, quick recap, Kyle, how'd you play? Uh, dog shit is the way to sum up my round. Um, what was it, 36 over? Um, so yeah, I don't know if I'll come back tomorrow. I'll drive back to Melbourne tonight. And another man who got 36 over, but how are you feeling about it? Can way different. <laughs> Much happier. <laughs> Where does this go on YouTube or something? Oh, 